Okay, this week's project, we've got a Coyote KL9020. This is a real nice tractor, man. It's a 2015 model. Got the little Perkins 1104D in it. Came in for a complaint of excessive white smoke. Running rough. It was dumping raw fuel. It would burn your eyes out in the shop trying to run it. We'd have to shut it off pretty quick because it was so obnoxious. But... Knowing what we know about Perkins, they're very susceptible to air intrusion into the fuel system. It'll throw them out of time, so we put our clear tube on here, and yeah, she's definitely sucking air, no doubt about that. So we went about trying to locate that and um, replace some dry rotted fuel lines. We actually put a new transfer pump on it, and it seemed to help. We got it to where it was sucking clear fuel, uh, but it still wasn't quite right. It still had some white smoke, so went ahead and yanked the injection pump off of it. Took the front cover and everything off to get it out. Uh, yeah, these Perkins, so if you're going to do one of these, you do need the timing tool for them. Make sure this thing's on top dead center and your pump's locked before you pull it. Don't get it out of time. You're going to have a bad day if you get it out of time. So got the pump on the table. Uh, again, I think it's something with the time in advance in it. Our experience with these little Delphi DP-210 pumps, they're a little bit notorious about grenading on you. So we'll take it apart and see if we can see anything in here. Uh, I got the cold start advance off of it. It seems to be working okay. I don't really see any trouble with it. But when we flip it over here in the rack, which that moves, uh, it, was, it had sticky spots in it. You get to a certain point and then it just bind up. You couldn't move it. Uh, and we found metal particulate everywhere when we pulled that off. So this is all junk. We're going to need a new pump, need new injectors. Got with our local diesel shop. They got us a new pump, set of injectors. So you get these installed. Everything come out real nice with that. Fired it up. No smokes, no leaks. Um, running really good now. So we took it out in the field, got it under a load, got it up to operating temp. She's running like a champ. All right, see y'all next week.